I will show you an idea that I had for 30 days of Ableton Push, but I decided not to do it for the sake of time, but I'll show you guys right now. The cool thing you could do is go and grab Momentary Pro 8, or 8 Pro, whatever it's called, and then you can use this as an effects rack. You could use it in the drums before, so you could use, there's eight uh, effects that you can use, and you could use in the drum rack using eight here, but now that their note mode has a sequencer in it, a step sequencer, you can now sequence your effects using momentary eight. So I'll quickly show you how to set it up. Go into the device, and I'm going to set the notes. So we're just going to be in C. So we've got everything set up for the notes now. Let's change the minimum and maximum is fine. The glide, we'll mess with it in a second. I'm going to change the amount on all of these to 100%. So this will get 100% of the velocity. And Map this to the drum rack. And I've actually already mapped one, so I'll just show you. Just click Map Me, and then select whatever parameter you want, and then it'll be mapped. So let me turn that off, close this. I already have one here. forgot to mention, now you can change the type of scale with the rotary. Alright. This one's not really doing anything, so let's hold it down and see if we put it to two steps, so it'll do something. There we go. thing about this is you can use multiple notes with the drum rack you can use multiple notes but you have to go from one note view to another note view here you can see all the notes of your effects mm -hmm. 